All right, folks, what is up? This is One Big Bug, and I am coming at you with League of Legends, but this is a special League of Legends, as this does not involve me, as you see the team across the bottom. It's the team I'll be casting for with Furious on Maokai, Big Bonded, Bonded, playing Leona, Xtrox on Ramus, or maybe that's Xtro X, uh, X, Percy Jones X on Gnosis, and Volibear will be played by... Semi-Tyrio, Tyrion, Tyrio, something like that. Now, the reason I agreed to cast this game is this was supposed to be a troll game. The entire bottom row, if you don't already know, is nothing but tanks, or at least people that can be tanks. They can fit other roles a little bit, but, um, <coughs> yeah, <coughs> we, got a, we got a full makeup of tanks down there. And, uh, well, you'll just have to see, because I'm going to be honest, I'm going through this with you the very first time as well. Uh, I have not seen this game. I'm just going to shoot from the hip and see what happens. But they're, they're up against Volibear, Gangplank, uh, Is Israel, uh, Israel, uh, damn, frame rate, one sec. <coughs> there we go, frame rate fix. And uh, as I was saying, uh, Israel, Israel, whatever, uh, Wukong, and Kale, who I will probably call Kyle very, very often. So again, I'm not sure what's going to happen. I'm not sure who ganks what. Or... Um, who dies where or whatever. But, uh, yeah. Let's see. the Poking down into the uh, first bush at least. With Leona hanging back. Ramus looking like he's going to try and pick up the blue. Um, interesting. No leash. Oh, there's the leash. Maokai is there with the leash uh, for Ramus. And Gnosis will be taking the solo top. They're not talking to everybody yet, so that's interesting. So let's slow this down and, and see where we get... Um, there we go. We have uh, Kyle and Gangplank. Uh, there we go. I already called her Kyle. It's Kale. Kale and Gangplank in the... Um, lower lane and yeah one thing I know is that Leona dies a little too often but there we go Volibear returning the uh, favor but he ends up going down to Gangplank and uh, yeah not the greatest in the lane down there but yeah funnier things have happened as you'll see You see Ram is speeding around to pick up the red in there. And uh, Gnosis uh, duking it out with Wukong up top. Gangplank trying to push up in the tower. Will not make in time before Leona gets there. The one thing I do know, and I'm not knocking Big Bonded or Big Boned or Boned. It's not Boned, is it? No, it's Bonded. Is that she does die a lot. I saw the game already, and I think she dies like 14 times, but it really doesn't matter. I, I think maybe she does a lot of initiating and allows for a lot of kills. Now I forget who this is perspective from. I'm pretty sure it's from Furious, which means it's from the perspective of uh, Mao Kai there. Get him, little dude! <laughs> I love Mao Kai just for that. But Gnosis in a bit of trouble up top with a very large minion wave. You know, they, they won't do a ton of damage to the tower, but they will do enough. But uh, Gangplank having gone back here, leaving only Kale. Um, in the lane down low for now until uh, Gangplank returns. I I would think that maybe the best thing for Gnosis to do at this point would be to stay near his tower and just not allow large mini waves to, to build up by pushing out this far and being outdone by Wukong right now. You're going to allow Wukong to build up a, uh, a sizable um, 
minion wave. And yeah, you see, there you go. Gnosis goes down. But Ramus picks up um, Wukong in the process. So a one for one. Keeping them down, only one kill. As the top lane looks like they're pushed back a little bit. Not too bad, though, by the appearance. Kyle, Kale, harassing from the... Um, from the bushes, trying to get Leonis, not going to happen. Calling for help, calling for a gank down bottom. Ramus though, having to sustain the mid lane up there. And yeah, they do dive in and they get... Um, mm, trouble in paradise. As the bottom lane goes down. But here comes Ramus. There goes the taunt. Picking up Gangplank. Now standing toe to toe with um, Kyle. Will flash over the wall to get away. Uh, down two kills at this point. But Ramus starting to become fed. Here comes Wooly Bear in the return. Now two on one. Uh, Wooly Bear is a bit hurt. But Ramus is even more hurt. And is in the two on one situation. Putting them down three kills for now. Let's see. Here, here's that problem again. Here's uh, Gnosis coming out too far. Allowing uh, a large minion wave to build up. And that could push, it, push the tower even just a little bit. And even just a little bit can be too much. And there you go. There's the ulti up top. You know, if you're being outplayed, you just need to tower hug. That's all there is to it. So down four kills right now. Now, I'm going to be honest. This is not a bad thing to them. I'm pretty sure they were expecting to lose. But, um, well, we'll just have to see. we got a big mix-up down bottom. Leona going down again. And Volley Bear getting killed again. And that'll leave the bottom lane to be pushed. So we'll speed this up a little bit. I love how they're getting cocky. Ooh, quick zip out taunt. He doesn't have his ulti though, so he's not going to be able to do much other than harass a little bit. An enemy has been slain. Oh, I wasn't paying attention as Leona picked up Volibear down bottom, probably with help of the turret. Ah. Fail on my part, so apologies to uh, Big Bonded there that uh, I, I missed that kill. Now, being down five kills can be bad, but not terrible. Just to be honest, it's not a terrible thing. You can be down by much more. All right. The problem I've seen with Leona and... Um, I don't know if it, mm, minions. I don't know if Big Bonded, if you've played Leona before, maybe it's because of the perspective it's from. But I did not see a shield initiation there. If you're gonna dive a hero or go into a bush, you always put up your uh, solar shield or uh, whatever the heck it's called. I'd have to relook at the abilities. Uh, you preload that, you preload your stun, then you do your dive into the hero. Uh, you always max out your, um, your solar shield, your bubble shield first. Because that will do the most damage and protect you the most if you're in trouble. Looks like we have a gank incoming. No, maybe not quite close enough. Oh, well. As we're now going two on one up top as Wooly Bear has come up. I believe Wooly Bear is their jungle. And is helping to push the top lane. Ramus needs to get up there. Still going in for Israel again. Not going to happen. As the top tower is pushed. But uh, forcing a fallback. You'll love how they're getting cocky. Here's an ulti that didn't do a lot. Going to gank the bottom. There's the taunt on Gangplank. Flipping him the wrong direction. 
into the safety of his tower. Uh, Ram is flashing away. Now in full retreat. See, I swear I heard the shield start. So maybe what I'm telling Big Bonded, like I said, m maybe it's because the perspective, I don't see your shield activating. But uh, if you play Leona, really? If you play Leona, you always max her, uh, I believe it's W. You, you take her Q first, then her W, then her sword dash, and then you max her, uh, her Q above all. And then you max her stun at second, and you max her sword dash last. So it looks liking, yeah, it looks liking, liking. Yeah, tower will go down first. Maokai is doing a really good job, Furious here, of pushing the mid, uh, keeping Easy at bay. Bottom lane is struggling a bit right now, obviously, but uh, only down five kills still. Five, uh, five kills down is not insurmountable. As Ramus is going after Wooly Bear. There's a slow, but it won't last long. And Ramus is building speed with the taunt. Taunt not lasting very long. Israel's going to come and protect um, Wooly Bear as well as Kale. But there's Wooly Bear with the flip and the slow. Ramus comes out, intercepts Israel again. There's the taunt, but unfortunately it hits a minion. Wooly Bear with the ulti will be forced to retreat. Here comes a flash in of Maokai diving in, unfortunately getting a minion. And the other team is now in full retreat, will make it to the safety of their tower. Uh, too bad that dive just missed and ended up getting a minion instead. Leona coming up from the bottom lane now as well. As we're starting to build towards a 4v4 in the mid. No, Wooly Bear is headed up to the top to... Um, try and help with Wukong uh, leaving Ramus down here with Maokai and Leona falling back uh, leaving the tower alone but it doesn't look like they're pushing too hard for it as Wooly Bear helping to turn around the top lane with uh, Gnosis up there Furious doing a fairly good job holding off uh, up top, Gangplank coming in to even the odds up top, but no big deals up there. Leona, probably the smart thing is to stay down the bottom and um, farm because she's fallen behind having died uh, as often as she has. I don't know if these were all friends or if these were... Uh, you know, PC Potatoes, just people I don't know, I haven't played with. So there's the dive-in by Maokai and the punch. Just a little harassment on EZ up there. Ramus coming in up top. Here comes the gank. There's the taunt on Wukong. That would be the flip. Down goes that. I don't know where Ramus is quite going. But there's the ulti picking up... Um, Volley Bear, unfortunately, things not going in their favor. Now down six kills. Tough start for the team. Israel trying to come in, gets a turnaround. As this is, I don't know if this is the type of fight that you want. Looks like maybe a, a fail flash there. Gnosis going into his ulti, standing toe to toe with uh, Gangplank. Uh, Israel coming in to help. And unfortunately, Gangplank following him from behind. There's the ulti, and Gnosis ends up going down. Not quite sure what that was. And Ramus going down as well. Wow, man, they're having a hard time. Wait, maybe they can at least pick up Volley Bear as we get a flip, and I'm going all over the damn place. But Crit Clank, Crit Clank coming in and turning the tide. I'm thinking that by this point, all, by all accounts, these guys should lose this game. As that Wooly Bear still being uh, very, very cocky. <laughs> I 
And there's another big crit. And yeah, killing the tower, that's not going to help that ego, is it? Volibear coming down to protect the tower against Volibear. You know, right now they're just not grouped up enough, I think. They've gone into several situations where they've been outnumbered. And tankiness is not going to make up for being in a two-on-one. In comes Ramus. There he goes. There's the taunt. Tower goes down. At least I thought there was a taunt. No defensive curl. Volibear ends up going down again. Man, they are in trouble. There's the taunt, bringing Volibear back. There's the slow dive in by Gnosis. The invulnerability by Kale will allow Volibear to back out. But there's another taunt using the tower to their advantage. Kale in trouble, having to flash out. There's a flip. Not letting Kale get away as they're starting to turn this around and Kale goes down. Volibear is taunted. There's the defensive curl. And there we go. Maokai picking up Volibear as they are down eight kills right now, but picking up two kills uh, finally in return. There's another dive in by Maokai. Gangplank on the way back. Volibear uh, going for the run in, but having to turn around. You see that massive crit ability by um, Gangplank, especially that he is a bit fed right now, already has an Infinity Edge in there. That's very devastating uh, to uh, the team. Leona hiding in the bush, maybe trying to set up a, uh, a stun. Trying to catch one of them out of place, maybe use her ulti. Why she didn't, I don't know. If you're going to set up for that, if you have your ulti, use it. Maybe she didn't. Maybe she ended up using it prior and I didn't see it. You'll have to forgive me, Big Bonded, if you see this. I'm very partial to Leona. She's my second choice in tanks and can even oftentimes be my first choice, depending on the team we're going against. So I, I tend to be overly critical, which is kind of funny, considering I'm not that good at this game. I'm better than I used to be, but not as good as I should be. That's my opinion. So, some confrontation going on up top as they drive back Wukong. Ram is coming out looking for Wukong, but he's already back in the safety of his tower. Maokai pushing the top uh, turret. Maokai right now, the only one, I believe out of the entire uh, tank team that has not been killed. Now chasing down Volibear. Here comes Blitzcrank in return. Down goes the defensive curl. Down goes the ulti. In comes Leona. There's her shield as Volley becomes the focus. Unfortunately, that may not be the greatest idea. Not with, Blitz, not with Gangplank there, but Gangplank does go down. Going after Leona. I don't think that was the wisest idea of Volibear. There's the taunt. The invulnerability goes out. Ramus goes down. His help comes in. Maokai in trouble will end up being killed. And now they are down 10 kills. Man. Well, with most of the team dead, why don't we speed this up? As Volibear looking like he's trying to push the turret down bottom. We'll have uh, Kyle come in. Kale. Kale. Damn it. I mean, all things considered, depending on how, how many times uh, the team has died so far, not horrible. Not horrible at all. Just based on the fact that they're only down two turrets. Well, that was a nice move on Wukong's part. But, uh, yeah, Ram is just a little too fast. There's the taunt trying to get away, being followed. Um, um, yep. There, there's the uh, decoy still giving chase, though. As Decoy is down, will juke the other way. Continuing to juke out. Unfortunately, he will be sandwiched at this point. And that will finish him off as Gangplank comes in with his ulti. Ramus goes into offensive curl, but Gangplank falling back as he knows he is outmatched at that point. Even being fed. 
Maokai trying to stand in there is going to be pushed back by Kale, especially with the red buff. Turns around with the diamond and a quick knockback. Here comes um, Gangplank. Here comes Israel. Kyle in the back. Knocks him back, trying to make it to the safety of his tower. Will just barely make it after a 500 crit. Does get killed, but now Kale finds herself in trouble getting taunted in the tower. Giving Ramus another kill. Ramus looking like he's going to be the carry for the team. There's the slow on Gangplank as they're looking to get him. He flashes over the wall. That's an interesting Gnosis uh, uh, ability right there. Bully Bear coming in, continuing the pursuit on uh, Israel. Unfortunately, it does not happen as the sword throw falls just short. You believe me, I know how that feels. Ten kills to twenty. Hmm. That's a tough one. It looks like they're stacking primarily armor and... Uh, well, considering Volley Bear is more or less AD, Gangplank is AD, Israel's going AD, Wukong is tanky, also AD, Kyle is kind of a hybrid, so there is some AD in there as well. Why not stack armor? It would make sense at this point, as we have a bit of a confrontation starting to build up in the middle. Leona standing in the back, waiting to uh, jump in. The other team does not come forward, though. There is Israel. Leona still waiting in the uh, wings. Maybe waiting a little too long. Narciss, uh, Narciss, Narciss, um, trying to farm the top. Up will come Wukong. This is something I would be a little concerned about because the entire team's missing. There's nothing to say. They're not coming for you. I love how Narciss is just kind of ignoring Wukong right now, finishing off the wave. <coughs> that is kind of uh, funny right there. Israel, uh, Israel and uh, Maokai still facing off in the center lane. Ramus coming up with double buffs. Look like he's trying to set up a gank. Will not wait in the bush. Immediately goes in. Grabs the taunt as they start to go on the attack. There's the dive forward trying to get to his turret. There's another powerball. There's the uh, fake out trying to get him. The taunt backing out of the turret trying to keep uh, Wu Kong down. And they do finally pick him up. As um, Gnosis goes into his ulti, up comes Gangplank, but Maokai coming from behind. Down goes the damage reduction ulti, and pop, Gangplank goes down. This Furious picks him up as Maokai. And it looks like this tower will fall, pulling to within eight kills now. Very nice. I don't know why. I seem to be, like, clicking on this game. I think it's because I want to do a really good job on it. You know, because this is the first one that doesn't involve me. But anyways, we have... There's a flip on Kale as we get a big team confrontation in the middle. Nas is going right after Israel. There goes the ulti from Maokai, keeping Kale in it, trying to pick up the blue in the middle of a team fight. That will cost uh, Kale as she goes down, continuing the pursuit on Volley Bear. There's the down, and there's the slow with the flip up. There's the stop on Israel, the taunt. And there we go, Nas is picking up the kill. Wukong used his ulti, they're fighting under the tower. This is not the best place to be at this point, as health is very low. It's looking as Gangplank will pick up Maokai. No, does not, having to use his ulti to protect himself as Ramus goes down. But Volley Bear picks up Volley Bear, if that makes sense. And now there's Gangplank uh, going after Volley Bear and Wukong. He is in trouble looking for help from Gnosis as there's a big hit starting to return fortunes around. Unfortunately, Volley Bear goes down, but Gangplank is in trouble. Gangplank does get picked up by Gnosis. Now Gnosis needs to get his butt out of there. There's a flash and all that, but still not enough as the slow will allow Gnosis to back out. Plus, even if... Uh, Wukong does get the kill. Gnosis, as you can see, is, um, I don't know why he has that aura around him. I thought maybe he had, um, the angel armor, but he does not. But he does have a, a war mogs already. But very interesting team fight. It looks like there's a stun down. There's somewhere that Leona does not want to be as Volley Bear is starting to chase her down. His, t his dash will run out as she continues to retreat. 
Wooly Bear giving up the pursuit. No, he's continuing to pursue. Oh, that is not good as she crosses path. Now he'll be able to catch up to her. There's the stun, but it will not be enough, and Leona will pay for that. Looks like Maokai going after Gangplank. Gangplank fed, but so is Maokai. Maokai is much tankier. And they're just going to stand there and duke it out. Unfortunately, Volley Bear will come in and ruin it. But here comes the other Volley Bear from the other side. Will not be in time. But Ramus also coming in. Flashes forward. Screw the other Volley Bear. I'm going for Gangplank. There's the taunt with the fail flash. There's the rumble as he does pick up. Uh, Gangplank still in his uh, ultimate, managing to get out of there using his defensive curl. Volley Bear in a bit of trouble. Ramus using his ball to delay so that Volley Bear can get away. And um, I love it, still laughing, and yet these guys are starting to make a comeback. Another great play on Ramus to use his power ball and then the defensive curl to help get away there. But now that tower will fall as there's just not enough people to protect it. I'm not sure how miss, but great play by Leona to stun Wukong under there. Unfortunately, the tower will still go down as there's too many. Leona just sacrificing herself to the wolves at this point. Maybe trying to prevent a further push. Here comes the rest of the team. Ramus' ball will get stopped. And the target does seem to be Kale at this point. Down goes the ultimate. Kale does go down. Too much action to keep track of. Volley Bear, the enemy team Volley Bear is falling. He is almost dead. Down he goes. Volley Bear picking up Volley Bear again. This time the target looks like it's to be uh, easy. There's the power ball. There's the dash. He tries to juke to the side. Does not make it. The taunt in. Israel is done as Maokai picks him up as well. <sighs> now I can breathe. There we go as they go to pick up the tower. And this game is starting to look like a game more than a route. Dive in. There's the flip out. Bully Bear in trouble. Does get the bite off. Ramus not going to back out. Goes into the tower. But he's in trouble now. Dint into the defensive curl. But will not be enough as he gets killed. The rest of the team diving in. Gangplank in trouble. Wukong in trouble as well. Fighting under the tower. He's probably dead. Yes, he is. Oh, that is too bad. That was a, just too much tower diving right there. And ultimately ended up finishing Maokai in the end. That's a shame. If they weren't under the tower, I believe Maokai would have easily finished both of them. And all I gotta say, folks, is if you think this is easy, you try casting this game. Now I know how sportscasters feel. You know, what I'd really love at this point is to actually be able to cast uh, one of the major tournaments that like Riot puts on. Like they got the $5 million prize pool. I really think I could do that. Except for the fact that I have the tendency to mispronounce champions' names. And if I mispronounce champions' names, I'm even more prone to mispronounce um, player names. So I think that's the only thing that would prevent me from being somebody who does this on a more professional level. But here we go. Team confrontation coming in. There's the ulti from uh, both Volley Bear and Gnosis. Big mix-up in the middle. Israel trying to flash out. Kale attacking like crazy from the, uh, from the bush. There's another powerball. I can't even keep track of what's going on. It's a freaking mess in there. But Ramus does finally go down. Flashing slowing this way and that. Oh, man, Volley Bear going down as well. Now standing in one-on-one -on -one versus Maokai. There's the ulti. It will not be enough as uh, continuing to duke it out. Two heavy bruisers at this point just going toe-to-toe. -to -toe. But the reality is, is that Wukong is just not strong enough to take out Maokai. But this does go against the tanky team as uh, you also saw the Gnosis went down. So at this point, they're down 11 kills, going falling back in the wrong direction. We can say down, but not out, folks. Down, but not out. And you see the scores right now. Maokai is 5-5. Five and five. Poor Leona, 2-9. and nine. Man, you needed me in there to play Leona. No offense, Big Bond. It's just, like I said, she's my favorite. 
Uh, Trox is seven and uh, six. Gnosis is four and four. Volley Bear having a tough time as well at three and eight. You see the enemy team here. Israel is struggling a bit with a lot of assists. Only uh, one differential there. Wukong five and three. Kale eight and six. Gangplank being the carry right now at eleven and six. And uh, this is turning into be a pretty tough fight as we got three up top. We got two of the enemy team stacked in bottom. Ramus is on his way up. Leona just sticking to the bottom lane, trying to farm. The bad part about this is you tend to overextend as you go for the towers. Then you become the focus for the entire team. But right now, we have a three-on-one pursuit to Ramus. Um, as fast as you are, Volley Bear, you're not going to catch Ramus. <laughs> Ramus is one of the few that will outrun you. And Leona look like she's being chased now. See, this is exactly what I'm talking about. In terms of being overextended, you now become the focus of the rest of the team. That looked like it was a solar flare. Ramus coming in with the powerball and flashing straight into Kyle, saving Leona as fortune start to turn. There's the dive in. Kyle may be in trouble. No, Leona goes down. Kyle does go. Kale does go down to Ramus. Ramus trying to get out, but it will not help as Gangplank picks up yet another kill. Let's see what's happening here. Looks like we're going to have a major confrontation. There goes the ultimate with the flip. Volley Bear trying to get away, and that is just not going to happen as he will go down yet again. I'll tell you, folks, if it had been anyone else, this game would have been over by now if it had been any other kind of team. But these guys are trying to hang in there, are trying to make something of this. Signaling for a fallback into the tower. As he will make it into the tower. There goes the ignite. There goes the slow. He's just got a ton of health. That won't help as he's going to try and go down to the bottom. He won't get out. Here comes Ramison at high speed. There's the ton of Wukong as he knows his Wukong being in there low. Wukong managing to flash over the wall. Barely saving himself. However, uh, Israel goes down. The pursuit is on for Volley Bear. There's the dive in. And Leona picks up a kill. Very nice. Gangplank trying to push this outer side. Does get the turret. Uses the speed. Uses a slow. Ramus goes into his powerball. He is slow at the moment. That, that, that does not mean he cannot catch Gangplank. Unfortunately, the minions will intercept the powerball. And Gangplank will get away. It does look like... like it does look like a fairly dire situation right now as two turrets in two lanes are down. One turret in the top lane is down. And you are down immensely in kills, being down 11 kills right now. So, you know, things are not looking all that good. Uh, they haven't been looking good for the entire game, but this team just refusing to quit. Staying in there, digging in, trying to fight. See, the other team is MIA at the moment, so we shall fast forward this. Now, there's a suggestion that they need for a while a bit a massive group up as they start going after Kyle and um, Wukong, and there they go picking on Kyle. Kyle used her. Uh, I'm just gonna freaking call her Kyle and live with it. But Gangplank picking up Leona up there. Kyle says lag. No, the reality is, Kyle, you used your ulti to save Wukong, and that allowed the rest of the team to pick you up. This is really what this team really needs to start doing, is traveling in a pack. I mean, you're a bunch of tanks, for crying out loud. Travel in a pack. Down goes the ulti, but is that really going to bother them? No. When you got this many tanks, you don't have to worry about the tower. Because they are starting to push the lower lane right now. Oh no, a disconnection. Was that uh, the enemy team's Wooly Bear or was it this team's Wooly Bear? Not entirely sure. But Gangplank trying to back door is not going to make it. Leona just missing her sword throw. 
getting her shield up, staying in defense of the tower. Gangplank looking like he's going to push, but there's Maokai angling to get him. There's the dive in with the slow. There's the punch. Leona starting to come down. The sapling now in the chase. I don't exactly know what Leona was throwing at. She was way too far short. If she had had her ulti, she could have tried to ulti him. But look at what we got here. <coughs> Pardon me. As the team has pushed down inside. Maybe a little too far. I thought maybe they took this tower, but they did not. Diving in for the kill and not getting it. You know, you know what's funny is everything's always quiet for most of the day. Nothing's going on. Everything's uneventful. And always when I go to cast, the phone starts ringing, dogs start barking, things like that. It gets rather annoying at times. Let's see, going diving in, going straight for Gangplank. Down goes two ultis as Gangplank will um, start to get out. But there's a stun by Leona going in, her shield going up, standing in against her. Down goes the Solar Flare. Gangplank being forced to flash away, nearly dead. He dished out some damage on Leona, but not nearly enough. You see, Leona is the most underfarmed of the team right now with uh, absolutely no armor except for the Ninja Tabbies. Maokai probably being the most fed, or if not, then it'll be uh, Ramus. There they are going in after Maokai. Down goes the double ulti there as they're fighting inside Maokai's uh, ability. Leona will end up going down there as we got a full-on brawl inside. Finally, the ability goes down the ulti. Israel gets taken down. Wukong using his... Um, Ability to get away, trying to juke around this way, trying to juke around this way, flashing this way, going that way. Not really the smartest thing, especially when you're considering that you're up against Ramus and Volibear. You're not going to be able to run very far. There's the power ball. There's starting to punch. Maokai dives in with the stun. There's the taunt. Unfortunately, it is on the clone. Kale comes in using her ulti to protect. But now Kale becomes the target as she is vastly uh, unprepared to take on that much damage. As Ramus and Volibear start to pursue, will they be able to catch her before she gets away? Ramus definitely has the speed for it. There's the pickup. There's the taunt into the defensive curl. Down Kale goes. Unfortunately, Maokai in trouble because of that. Being left alone against Gangplank and Wukong will die. But can Reprisal come in as there we go. There's the taunt into the defensive curl. There's Volibear with the flip. Is that the fake? Yes, there's the clone right there. Chase is beginning again. He uses the dash in to go the other way, but Volibear catches him, flipping him over. And I believe... Ooh, nice try. Nice last-ditch effort, but that's not enough as Wukong does end up going down. And Gnosis trying to push the tower up top. He ends up going down. He does have the Archangel armor. I was just looking at the wrong thing. Or Guardian Angel. As he works to make his getaway... Trying the ulti, but you know, utterly missing, and he will make it away as Volibear starts to come over, diving into the tower. I wouldn't call this the wisest of moves, especially with a damage doer like Gangplank. I don't care if you're a tank or not, and yeah, that will end up being the end of that. Ram is trying to go after Kale into the tower again. I know this is a troll game, but you got a chance to win here, guys, as you've pushed back as hard as they've pushed you. Israel does go down. There goes the ignite on Ramus. Ramus, vastly low on health, will go into his power ball. Gangplank trying to use all the speed ability he can to catch Ramus, but Ramus just too fast. Why Ramus turned around, though? I don't know. I think he could have gotten away. Despite being down 11 kills right now, they are well pushed in, uh, have pushed back, gaining uh, quite a lot of ground in terms of turrets. Uh, we can see the builds right here. They all got uh, Shirelia's Revere. Uh, they all have Ninja Tabbies. 
Um, looks like we've got a lot of thorn males in there, a few rendering omens, some uh, sunfire capes. Uh, definitely building anti uh, anti attack damage because this entire team is pretty much attack damage except for Kale, who's hybrid. Down goes the ulti, too slow Gnosis, but Gnosis just powering through it. There is another slow, they dive forward, Gnosis goes into his ulti. As he just starts standing in there, Maokai comes in as well. Gnosis will go down, but the other team could be in trouble. Gangplank trying to get away, will not do it. Well, there's the reconnection, maybe that could have been the turning difference. Uh, Volley Bear going down. Wukong in trouble though. Maokai with the dash forward. Not enough as it is the fake. Wukong trying to get away and oh trying too hard is Maokai. But here comes Ramus. Will the other people still be there when Ramus gets there? He is more than strong enough to finish them off. Turns around in his powerball. Now giving chase. Wukong. <laughs> nope that taunt will be on the wrong one. Unfortunately now the entire team shows up and that's going to be a little too much. Um, versus Ramus, I was going to say, but ends up not being. Um, Volley Bear, as you can see, uh, just auto attacking, auto attacking, so he's DCing again. The chase is on. Will that be the clone? It is now. It wasn't to start with. The chase is on again. Ramus into his Powerball, starting to pick up speed. Using the dash to get forward. There's the slow. And... Yep. Now Ramus in trouble. There's Volley Bear as he's come back. Ramus into his powerball trying to get away. A double flash forward. Uh, <laughs> stuck? Nope, just lag. And he actually gets away using that speed ball. Uh, well, maybe he did. There's still pursuit going on. There we go, using the Shirelia's Revere. Gnosis turns around, goes right into Gangplank. There's the flip over by Volley Bear. Gangplank in trouble. Not, uh, Ramus is about to go down. Ramus goes down, but Volley Bear pays for it, being picked up by Volley Bear again. Was that the perfect counter for Volley Bear? Maybe, just maybe, Volley Bear. Wukong is after Leona again. Again, poor Leona suffering in this game having died so often and she is in full retreat versus Wukong but he's going to have to chase her a long way he's got some of her health down but not a lot and she's leading him right into Maokai Wukong backing off though you can see with Gangplank though if Gangplank gets caught he's in danger he's basically just a gas uh, gas a glass cannon if he's caught um, it, it's basically over. Here we go. Three on two. Volley Bear in trouble yet again. Double Shirelia's Revere. Or maybe it's just one. And there they go with the escape running away. Are they still being pursued? Yes, there's Wukong. There's EZ. But incoming Maokai as well. As Volley Bear continues to back out. Staying in the bush. Now they turn around onto... Gnosis, but here comes the rest of the team. Ulti, ulti, uh, as we get one from Israel and from Wukong. The tanking is trying to keep them alive. Unfortunately, Volley Bear going down again. Kale might have been in trouble as Gnosis goes down, but he will come back up. Maokai picking up EZ in that confrontation. Now also picking up Kale and Wukong going down as well as they manage to turn it around and pick up quite a few kills. I believe, uh, yeah, there's Volley Bear and Gangplank. Now, they need to pay attention because it looks like Gangplank may try and backdoor on them, and they can't allow that to happen. You see, with all that tankiness, you can just walk in on a tower and beat it up. Looks like Gangplank not going to back door, being forced to come back, knowing that uh, his base is in trouble. There is the taunt on Gangplank using the oranges to get away. As they're just kind of going all out. There's a flip on Gnosis flipping him out. 
continuing that laugh even though at this point they are in trouble diving in on the tower going right after gangplank and damn he went down fast there's a flip over as Ramus will go down but he will come back up as well Holy Bear in trouble. They're fighting under a double tower and they just don't care. There they go. Going after uh, Gnosis. They will finally kill him as... Man, this is too much to keep up with. Kale goes down. Ramus goes down. Trying to run into the protection of the tower. Going after EZ. EZ goes down. Here comes Leona and Holy Bear back in the other direction as Maokai is in trouble. As tanky as he is, he's in against two other tanks, and he ends up dying. One hell of an exchange, still down 11 kills, 41 to 50, but... They have the ground advantage, taking out an inhibitor. Gangplank saying, problem is I'm too strong, I'm killing myself. That's re basically true. <laughs> Thorn mail on every single character out there, I believe, at this point. Everyone on this thorn, thorn, thorn. Th the only one that doesn't have thorn mail is Wooly Bear. Well, yeah, this is pretty much Gangplank is killing himself as much as uh, he's uh, being killed. You see that attack speed, and you, and you see the damage he can put out. 30% of that's going back against Gangplank, and Gangplank has uh, very, very little life. You see, he's pure glass cannon right now. Let's see, not much going on. Picking up the red buff. Maybe looking at Baron. It would make sense to go for it now. It may take the three of them a little while to get it, but they can take them down. I don't think you have to worry about tankiness right now. Oh, Leona finally showing up to help. Sorry, Leona, your shield toss does not work. Uh, your sword toss does not work on Baron, but there they go. They pick up the Baron buff now as well. And this could be problematic as uh, Kale is forced to come back and deal with this. There goes the chase on Wukong as they're starting to build up underneath. Going into the safety of the tower. Looking for the entire team to get there. Looks like Maokai and Gnosis are going to come around the backside. While Volibear, Ramus, and Leona keep them uh, occupied in the front. And there we go. Here comes the jump in. Fighting under the tower. Gangplank. He goes down with his ulti. Too much action to keep track of. Too many people in the middle. All I see is health bars going down left and right. It looks like the first victim will be Volibear killed by Leona. Israel going down to Gnosis. Now the focus is Kale and she ends up going down. Forcing back Gangplank and... Um, Wukong as they just dove under that under both towers uh, taking all kinds of damage but ended up killing th uh, three out of the five uh, at once going straight in on the tower they have a whole flight of minions this could be a really major turnaround folks and there we go you see the GG already there's nothing that can be done they are on the nexus Diving in onto the steps, not dying. <laughs> Finally going down as they just all start to dive onto the. <laughs> <laughs> they all just dove up onto the platform, but there's really not not much that can be done. As it looks like minions will eventually take this nexus. There you go. A hilarious ending to a very strange game. Oh my. The troll tanks win.
Or maybe you call them the tank trolls. Who knows? Either way, folks, there you go. The troll team wins an entire team of tanks and they just beat them down. Despite being down 11 kills, 12 kills, they just managed to get too tanky and push them back. Pretty damn amazing, folks. As always, though, if you're not playing League of Legends, follow the link down in the description below. Sign up, download the game, start playing. You'll enjoy it, I promise you that. If you already have an account, throw me a bone, will you? I'm trying to bring you fantastic gameplays and try and bring you some funny stuff. I'm going to be starting to mix things up, trying to bring live event reactions and all that. Uh, as well, so throw me a bone follow the link in the description down below make up another smurf account play it to level 5 for me I'd be greatly appreciative of it uh, Otherwise folks, I hope you've enjoyed watching this as much as I've enjoyed bringing it to you It was definitely a hilarious game overall as far as I've seen it and this is one big bugger I'm signing off and I'll see you next time